Lorraine Kelly took to social media to share her sad reaction to Prince Harry holding Meghan's hand for support as he walked behind the late Queen Elizabeth II's coffin. ITV presenter Lorraine Kelly shared an emotional update with her followers, as she reflected on the painful experience Prince William, 40, and Prince Harry, 48, must be having in the wake of Queen Elizabeth II's death. Lorraine, 62, also noted that it was so sad to see Prince Harry hold his wife Meghan Markle's hand for support as he walked behind his late grandmother's coffin in Wednesday's procession. In view of her 713,700 Twitter followers, Lorraine shared some BBC News footage of the royal family walking with somber expressions as the Queen's coffin was transported through the streets from Buckingham Palace to Westminster Hall. The news clip was titled, King Charles III and his sons Princes William and Harry walk behind the Queen's coffin as it's brought to Westminster Hall. Reflecting on the moment, Lorraine wrote, hard for all of them but especially William and Harry, must have brought back painful memories of their mom. I noticed Harry held Meghan's hand for support as they left. So sad. On Thursday September 8, it was confirmed that the Queen had died at the age of 96. In a statement, Buckingham Palace said the monarch had died peacefully at her Balmoral estate, surrounded by close family. The new King Charles III ascended the throne immediately after his beloved mother's death and paid tribute to her, saying that it had been a moment of the greatest sadness for me and all members of my family. An official coronation date is yet to be announced for the new monarch, but The Telegraph reported it will most likely be in spring or summer 2023, following a period of mourning. As Lorraine noted, it will undoubtedly be a difficult time for William and Harry both of whom will remember losing their mother, Princess Diana, at a young age. Diana died after she was in a car that crashed in the Pont de l'Alma tunnel in Paris, France on August 31, 1997. Driver Henri Paul, who died in the accident, is believed to have tried to speed away from photographers, following the couple, when he lost control of the vehicle and smashed into a concrete pillar. Diana's partner Dottie Alfade was also killed in the crash, while Mr. Alfade's bodyguard Trevor Reese Jones survived. 